All right, you're good. Just remember, whenever you hit start recording, it doesn't like immediately start recording. Okay. So I like, give it a little bit to. Oh, okay, got you. Like when you hit start recording, give them like ten seconds, seconds. and then. Okay, makes sense. All right. All right. So the rematch from last week. Um, I've actually been. Me and Chris have been in the lab a lot lately. Uh, uh -huh. I've been trying to coach Chris a ton. And it's the first time I think I've ever like seriously tried to coach anyone. Mm -hmm. And teaching is really hard because you have to figure out what they understand, what yeah. they don't understand, and then also what is the best way they learn. Um, but so far, I actually kind of feel like it's helping out Chris, or at least I assume. I'll ask mm -hmm. him after this. So, but this is so I can only assume this is not a good matchup for Olimar. It's not. It's not uh, mainly well, because I don't think Olimar has a whole lot of good matchups. He doesn't, and on top of that, um, the thing about this is, is that they both have disjoints. The only problem is the oh. other one. Wow, right in the middle of his. Oh, that's bad. That was not good. He's he has a flowered purple though. Yeah, but will it matter if he dies? He's still good. He's still recover high. Oh. Ooh, nice. Recover high. All right, preemptive F smash there. All right, but yeah, so living hitboxes means that Olimar's gonna be put a hit stun. His Pikmin are gonna be put a hit stun, uh, but Marf will come out a lot sooner. On top yeah. of that, he can actually just kill his option. Imagine if you could break the tip of Marf's sword. That's kind of what it's like yeah. uh, playing as Olimar, especially if you have purple. You know, Ooh. if he had a jump, I oh. thought he was gonna jump in up air, because that would have been yeah. a pretty good idea. Um, all right, stock down. He's got two purple, though. Making it possible to pick up this kill. Or a little bit more easier. Thought he'd roll in. He ends up rolling in. Ooh. Ooh. Hit him with that young perp. <laughs> All right. Okay, this is this is dangerous. Ooh, that situation. was scary. They both were, I mean, to be honest, Pancakes was in a good position. He was okay. Yeah. But it was kind of scary. Right now it's kind of scary. Didn't have his other jump, so he couldn't get the purple out. But that could have been quick kill setup. All right. All right. Doesn't get it. These purples are flowered now. We have practiced so much. <laughs> Hoping it. Ooh, could. man. Oh, the jump Whoa. catching him, running right into the tipper. All right, so Pancakes is up a pretty – he's got a pretty decent lead on himself. Yeah, he does. But this is definitely – Still doable. Yeah, Chris can definitely even this up pretty quickly. With the good old red, white, and blue. <laughs> America. <laughs> Never mind, it's gone now. <laughs> All right, running back. Let it, I think he's trying to give Pancakes some space to hang himself. He's just hoping Pancakes over his stands. Wait. Oof. Good yeah. wait, but Pancakes was ready for it. Wow. 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 This is not the best lineup for Chris right here. No, it's definitely not. Ooh, I'm pretty sure he used his jump. All right. All right. Did he use, wait? You said he used his jump uh, earlier. He he uh, he's hit the ground since then. Oh he, yeah, he didn't have a jump there. All right. It's still possible he gets an early kill, um, but he's gonna have to watch out for getting grabbed like this. These setups. And this is something that Pancakes is just super good, good at. at. Yes. His tech chasing is. Oh. Oh. Ouch. That was a great Ken combo. Yeah, it was. All right. The so game one goes to Pancakes. Um. Luckily, it's best five. You know, you, you get time to, to make the adu the adjustments, do the downloads. Let's see what's going on. Man, I smell pizza. I do, and too, and it's making I you hungry, I really right? want it. Yeah. What time do they close the cafe? Um, Is it at 8? I don't know, but you probably want to go now. I can hold your spot if you need be. Um, All right, starting off strong already. Doesn't get the, the, the edge guard he wanted. This could be a little bit deadly. He's in a poor position. Rolls in. Pancakes realizing this. Still attacking on that damage. Oh, man, that shield was looking a little tiny. It was. Trying right. to go for that shield breaker. All right, Chris. All right, giving him some room to just kind of hang out. Ooh, wow, a little too low. Didn't make it. All right, CP9 with a full stock lead. How? One thing Pancakes is really good is he realizes you had a stock lead, immediately changes up, looks for the ways that he can gimp you, looks for the ways that he can basically kind of stress you to kill yourself. He'll let you hang yourself if need be. Oh, yeah. Give you just a little bit of room. Just a little bit of he'll hang you with the rope that he gives you or however that saying goes. Yeah. I don't know. I can't remember how it goes. I think something like that. Oh, okay. Chris is getting damaged, though. Like, that's what he needs. Or CB9. 
Uh, I've been calling him Chris this whole time. Have you, yeah. I should probably stop. <laughs> all right, it's all good. Okay. Oh, my Ooh. God. He just runs off and does it. Okay. Chris now with a two-stock lead. We're seeing some new stuff. We really are. I haven't actually seen I that don't, I don't know if I've ever seen someone do that before. Oh. And, yep. Oh, but oh. that's too low. All right. Okay, they're both going to weigh out the invincibility. That's when you know it's serious. Oh, Nobody's yeah. playing games in here for the money now. <laughs> Ooh, tries to go with that blue grab. All right. He needs to be careful. Oof, like this I said, this this could, this could turn around really quickly. Something like that. That's all. He just needs to do that he needs one, more one more time. time. Zero to death. He's just do some more tech chasing. All right. He needs to, oh. Ooh, that was scary. It's, he could have done it's it. It's still scary. It's still scary. I don't feel like he's out of it yet. The pancake hurricane. <laughs> it's a fair. Oh, God. Okay. Wade Dash Running doesn't steal. Right oh, I think that's going to be it. Oh, no. Oh, this Why is awkward. Broken. Oh, oh my tech God, he like. takes. All right. Realizing he shouldn't roll in. I cannot believe he got that tech. He got that, that tech, was, and that was amazing. That, that was nuts. That might make it. Oh, okay. Hits him with the up B, but there's like a billion frames of end lag on it. Woo, woo, woo. Oh, uh, <laughs> rolls. I can't commentate. I'm sorry. That was all bad. But it was happening so fast that I could only react. Rolling, all right. rolling, rolling. <laughs> all right. Simple edge guard. Wow. Ooh, I think he was trying to wait out a spot, spot dodge, dodge or something. Yeah. Nice F smash. This could be it. Does he have time to pluck Pikmin? It's a simple roll up, and that's All one right. One. Game two goes to CP9. Um, I'm really hungry. You are. Um, yeah. I mean, I can, um, I can hold, I can hold it down here. Hey, Jake, you want to switch me out for just a little bit so I can yeah. go get some food? Go okay. All right. What you say? Just move down the line. Yeah. All right. Quickly, getting back into it right now. We're on battlefield. This is, I think, it's gonna be a pretty good stage for Marth. Uh, Olimar is gonna have a hard time coming through those platforms, but on top of that, um, it's gonna be easier to kill for the kill setups like uh, up tilt. Excuse me, and uh, also. Olimar does not have that many good options coming down. Not too many characters do, but... It's especially hard, it's hard for someone for like Olimar. Yeah, exactly. Oh, and gets him with the, kick, the quick dare. Almost makes it back. Is? Yeah, that's kind of surprising, actually. All right, let's change out. Commentators here. All, All right. right, no longer Sparty. We got Snock on the mic. Sparty over here. Oh, my God, he waited out. He's starting to pick up on that. All right. That could be a back air, and that is a back Cleans air. Cleans it up strong. Let me talk about Chris just for a little bit. Just playing absolutely out of his head. Oh, another dare. Another dare. He's going to have to figure out how to how to DI that. Um, yeah, we've been, I've been trying. I was telling Sparty about this. I've actually been coaching Chris um, for, like, the past two weeks now and trying to help him basically kind of find a better neutral. Um, Something that also kind of hard to do with Olimar. Like, he's not a bad oh. Oh. All right, he did out this time. It made all the difference. Not another early stock, but he's still in a bad – Carry a situation here. Can't roll back to ledge. Preemptively throwing out that fair. Got a lot of yellows, though, on deck. Yeah, he does. Quick access to the aerials. Oh, Unless you get tippered. The tip. <laughs> All right. It looked like this game won, to be honest. So, Down throw. Down throw. Oh, oh he, he had no jump? He, uh, he might have caught him uh, off at the second bounce trying to jump. Jump and just, yeah. All right. So, uh, All right. Let's Thanks. check out the bands. Um By the way, I want to say that's probably one of Olimar's like hardest matchups as a whole. Oh just yeah, because like Marth does have or he commandeers that like that much space. Space, right? And Olimar wants to kind of do similar. Like it's not the same thing. Of course, setups aren't the same, but at least that get in with the fair, start something up. That's uh, a no go. He's got live hurt boxes, which put him at a serious disadvantage. Oh man, that's a serious disadvantage. And this is a rough stage too because both. Both players want the same thing here. They really do, yeah. He was hoping he'd be able to kill off the side earlier. Mm -hmm. um, oh, okay. He leans back. Oh. Still making it hard, but I don't know. If right now, uh, Pancakes is playing a really dominant neutral. Very dominant neutral. He's looking for those dares a little. Quite a bit. <laughs> yeah. He's feeling confident after, what is it, just finding, uh, what is it, like two, three of them so far? Yeah. He did. Oh, uh, that can be bad. No, he DIs out. Chooses to go for a. Climbs the wall. Oh no! Doesn't get that. He was hope uh, he was really hoping the purple Pikmin would save him from having to deal with. Uh, oh, gets oh, a pop well. up to the down smash! Wow. All right. Okay, All right. He's gonna have to be careful. He's on the platform right now. 
All right. that was, I don't think that arrow is the right direction. All right, gets the grab. All right, is this something starting big? Is this something starting big? I can't. Oh, and he, and he gets it. I couldn't. <laughs> it started big, big stocks. <laughs> <laughs> you weren't wrong. Uh oh. Uh oh. All right, we're almost. Oh, you saw it rising. Yeah, I saw it. All right. Okay, this match starting to turn around. Uh, you know, purple's on deck right now. It's oh. looking kind of brutal. One this point. really changes up the matchup when you have these purples online like this. It still makes it, I mean, it's still hard. Don't get me wrong. Like, I'm not saying there's anything different going on, but. I mean, 60 sec. Oh, my gosh. Finds it right there. All right. He has one purple on deck, a yellow for speed, and a blue for grab. Let's see how he utilizes them. Down throw. Down nice. throw. Nice. Oh, oh, no. no. Oh, okay. okay. Pops him up at least. This could be huge. It could be. Chooses to roll in. Chooses to read the roll. <laughs> it's kind of scary. Does right. it get Oh. All, all he had to do was wait it out. Back throw. All right. Just chooses to relax, hang out. Oh, Catches him with the downward wow. angle. Chris coming back from a two-stock deficit, I believe it was. <sighs> That's something amazing. This, this <laughs> man has <laughs> adrenaline. This has is blood. A, <laughs> oh, my God. You know, it's not even blood anymore. It's just adrenaline. It's just <laughs> adrenaline. <laughs> um, he's had a pretty good run today. <laughs> Yeah. He's being Dill, he's being Dad, and possibly maybe Pancakes. We're not sure yet. Last game to decide it. Um, but like I was saying, yeah, me and Chris have been, I've been intensely trying to coach him. And teaching people is actually really hard. Because you, first you have to figure out what they know and what they don't know. And then once you figure that out, it's about, like, how do they learn and what makes sense to them. Right. Um, because if, it, if it's not translated well, then it could be a problem. All right, get into the game here. See if that coaching has helped CP9 out or if Good Pancakes clients. is finally – caught an on by the way i love olimar's down tilt oh his down tilt's so good yeah i was trying to tell uh what is it a dad a little bit earlier uh -oh. before he left uh -oh. about the intricacies of a uh, bear uh -oh. about how it actually bear. goes through the stage well i'm talking about angle it right oh yeah it feels awkward oh he um i thought that was a tipper and almost was uh man cp9 scared me with these was a little too uh, antsy there yeah you don't want to be crazy Catches oh. with that bear, though. And I feel like the Pikmin slowed him down, too, allowing for the cross to be kind of even more unsafe. I think we're starting to see a little bit of nerves from both players coming out here. Yeah, okay. All right, good DI to not instantly just <laughs> get bopped. Oh. oh, yeah, he wanted to roll back to ledge. All right, two yellows and a, uh -oh. and a blue. Gets the grab. Gets up air. Up air. Back air. All right, not. Ooh, having a hard time getting down. All right, gets the grab. This is where Pancake needs to make his, his run here. Gonna get that dare. Oh. Oh no. Instant yellow, man. Woo! Oh. Jumps preemptively. Might get the dare. I don't know. Pancakes has not been able to get this dare for a cool minute, to be honest. That climb. Yeah, it was nuts. You know, as much as I've taken Chris here, he should know. He should know this stage. Yeah, he <laughs> should. Uh, he is having a hard time getting nice. in. Finally makes it in. Gets the grab. Oh, oh man, he's Oh, oh my turn. god! <laughs> All right. Still looking Gets good. He's oh, barely he living. out of there yet? Not yet, not yet. Oh, oh my. my god. Down throw. All right. Used up his jump. All right. He's in a vicarious. I the, the release is actually smart in that position because you don't know what they're going to do. Dude, yeah, it's. Ah, uh, yeah, that's what he was waiting for. Okay. Make him feel desperate out of his options, you know what I mean? Exactly. All right. He's waiting for that grab. Oh, I just pops okay. him. Oh, oh, he barely makes it. All right. Oh, that's Back it. throw. <laughs> I don't think he knows how to DI that either. I mean, it wouldn't matter, but. At that percent, yeah. Yeah, okay. All right. Pancakes, trying to make the most of the stock already. Oh, that's barely so scary. Misses. It really is. Is CP9 going to come through or get F smashed? Uh-oh. All right, no tipper, though. Uh oh, he tried to do something, but the platform actually just stopped him from. All right, getting the grab. So this is a moment for CP9 to really make something happen. Doesn't. All right, Pancakes. Realizing he wants to go to the top, but doesn't get there fast enough. Oh, my gosh. This is so intense right now. The way he's controlling the stage is absolutely absurd. But, oh, oh just does he does really get it. that? Yeah, wow. he just went on <laughs> committed fully to it. Oh. Back throw. Oh, wow. Oh, that, that. Oh, <gasps> that. Oh. oh, he got the tech? <laughs> Oh, yeah, he, he's trying to find it. All right. 
Rough matchup, rough matchup. Oh, and that, and that is, is it. Big. Pancakes is going to Grands. Man. Wow. That was an insane set. TP9 has played really good all day today. Sh shaking his, his head, head yeah. You know he's not happy about Maybe that. After, after being one. Dylan, dad, it's still it, not. It's like, how? All right. Okay, guys. So I guess it's. Oh.